it is that time. It is that time. And now we take uh, oh, Justin well. Peter by surprise. Right. Well, oh, no. So, <laughs> and then she are, and then she are. Right, Here. okay, so. Karnak. Karnak. Johnny Karnak. Carson's Karnak. Remember? There you go. Oh, I see. That? Yeah. <laughs> that, that dates us, you know? Johnny yeah. Carson, remember? Oh. I well, <laughs> I now, when you said that, I, I didn't know if that was when you saying that's the moment to choose the one. Yeah. If not, I should put this back in because it's me choosing it. Otherwise, <laughs> I'll put it back in. So you say when. Sorry. And <laughs> I just like the fact that Justine had a purple. Well, we, my husband and I recently bought the purple mattress. So we got these little. Um, oh, excellent. Sleeping, I think. Well, I'll tell you what. Sleeping if you put it okay. on and just say when, and you won't know exactly when it's going to be. Okay. Know? Hold on. Yes. Okay, when? <laughs> oh, all right. <laughs> one of those, right? This is a different one. Oh, we choose. Well, just says right. Just says we choose. We choose. Oh. We choose. Oh, okay. well, should we? Uh, our guest, Justine, absolutely choose the genre. So you've got lots of genres to choose from on slaps, and <laughs> the world's your oyster. Oh, well, uh, naturally, I'm going to lean towards. I don't know ambient. That's oh, kind right. of a broad, broad yeah. category. Could be an interesting one. Ambient so, is like electronic. It's got so many sub. Yeah, yeah. Genres. Well, the thing is, that's that's I I got into a phase a few years back of um, just going to sleep to listen to some Vangelis albums, um, and. Actually, Soil Festivities album of Van Gogh's was one I just got hooked on. And then um, loads of Brian Eno. And I was just, and then some Tangerine Dream as well. And just, just falling asleep to that stuff is brilliant. And it's that sort mm -hmm. of ambience, particularly the Brian Eno stuff. I right. loved it. Fantastic. Yes, I did too. <laughs> <laughs> it's great. So, what's the latest? Well, we have one brand new track here from Fern Liz, uh, posted 18 minutes ago. Let's see. Fern Liz is from Rhode Island, United States. Here, ambient meditation. You know, now we might need to go for one that's slightly shorter. So is that one a three minutes? This one. This one is five minutes. Mind you, it doesn't really matter, does it? Well, no. I mean, this is what we're usually doing with the purple bowl. That's true. Purple bowl was decided. I don't. <laughs> I, I don't think we should tempt fate here. You know. So no, true. True. Yeah. Uh, so don't go we, against the bowl. Yeah. Um, not much of any kind of description here at all, except for the fact of uh, Rhode Island in the U.S. Uh, three tracks posted, 28 plays with three followers. Um, genres include new age, ambient, instrumentals, chill out, chill vibes, synth wave, rock and pop. The song was posted 18 minutes ago, though, available mm -hmm. on Spotify and YouTube as well, listed as new age and ambient. Here is... Fern Liz with uh, Blue Mist at Dawn.
All righty. I think we'll put uh, I think we'll put Miss Painter on the spot here since that was <laughs> <laughs> just, just you. What, totally you, unprepared here. What do you, um, you think? Well, obviously, it's background meditative um, yoga. Um, it's very very soothing. Um, I don't know how you guys stayed awake. <laughs> it's just really it's very calming. Um, but you know, listening to it more intently, of course, I. I wanted a little bit more in it, um, like, like effects. Um, uh, it, it lacked a, a pattern, it, it, like I wanted it to have a returning sound that it didn't have. It just kind of flowed at random. Um, there was a little dong sound and then a chime type of sound near the end. Um, that could be more consistently added along with something else maybe. I thought I heard a couple of flaws in the flow. It may just be the way that the sound is coming through, double through our speakers, um, headphones. Um, other than not that, it was, I mean, I guess it fit what she was intending, to, or she, he, I didn't look. She, she, was, she yeah. uh, was intending to accomplish. It was pretty close to her goal, I think. Um, it just it needed a little bit more for me. Carlos Fandango. Yeah, I'm, I was sort of hearing sort of elements of that Swell Festivities album, actually, the Van Gallis thing. Um, Terry Oldfield in there. It's nice. It's haunting. It's definitely it's aptly titled Blue Mist at Dawn. Feels like a blue mist at dawn. It's meditative, evocative. Yeah, I like those deep sort of chimes, those deep dong uh Tibetan bowl, whatever they might be, they're this yep. very nice sound. And uh, but um, yeah, I think this is the thing. It's like with a really long track from. Uh, so so take it on Justine's point uh, that if it's a long track, I think then you can have those recurring themes mm -hmm. coming in. And the short shorter track, the five I say shorter, it's five minute track, but the shorter track like a five minutes track. Um, yeah, you can still have those recurring themes, although I think it's more because it's meditative music. It's maybe that's the idea is that it just drifts and it just does its own thing and it just, just meanders. Like fog, mist. Yeah, I think so, yes. Yeah, just meandering and bringing just sort of different thicknesses of mist towards you and all that kind of thing. So, um, so I don't know. I, I, I really liked it. So I, I followed and uh, added some fire and saved it. So, um, I, yeah, I think that's definitely um, Fern's achieving her objective with the music and you know good at what she does and um yeah keen to hear more really um i agree uh here's here's what i was thinking about I, because the 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 name of the of the uh of i'm just gonna say the artwork here right ambient meditation music it's exactly what it is and i was kind of like picturing enigma so if you take enigma for like sadness for example right and you take out the heavy kick drum and you take out the bass then you're left with basically like, these, like <laughs> uh, you know you're basically left with like the buddhist monks kind of like chanting and and you know and you're left with that nice little melody which would definitely flow with with this one i think the blue mist at dawn um so i liked it i like that i like that little gong in there the ding you know mm. you, you can pick up there's subtle hints in the background which make this a very kind of relaxing song so imagine taking a song like sadness from an, from an enigma once again and uh, and just removing all the all the hardcore elements that make it like kind of like a more dancey song yeah and kind of like making it kind of like music to fall asleep to you know yeah uh, mm -hmm. music, music to meditate by once again ambient meditation right. like it, and it yeah. would exactly fit it does fit in that genre it's a really nice production the um the the, the melodies are, are are very up to par everything kind of like flows the way that it's supposed to and um and again not really not really an ab abrupt ending when there's not one to be to be had it just kind right. of fades away uh, fades away very nicely, I think. Yeah. Agreed. I liked it. I think that was a good choice from the Purple Bowl and from Justine combined. <laughs> <laughs> An awesome <Thanks>. team. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. oh boy, I've really listened to ambient music for a while, so it's made me actually get, might get me back into it again. Yeah, no, I, I had it playing on the monitors here, and it, and it sounded really good. And that was mm. that was something that I would definitely put on the um, put on the kind of like 
chill and and kind of like relax kind of mm-hmm. like playlist you know it, it would definitely it was good i like that i mean there's nothing wrong with it at all very nice yeah, yeah. beautiful more to come there